Welcome to problem number four from the June 2016 Algebra Regents exam. In this question, we've got a scatter plot and it's comparing the number of bags of popcorn to the number of sodas sold at each performance of a circus over one week. So we can see on the x-axis here we've got the popcorn sales and then up to the side on the y-axis we have the soda sales. And the question is which conclusion can be drawn from the scatter plot? So you can see we're just trying to find out what's the relationship between the popcorn sales and the soda sales. And as you can see from the data that there's definitely a pattern. It seems to follow that it's constantly increasing, which shows that as um, the more popcorn that's sold uh, kind of coincides with the number of soda sales. People probably typically buy both popcorn and soda at the same time. So uh, choice number one says that there's a negative correlation between popcorn sales and soda sales. And that's definitely not true because a negative correlation means that as one thing increases, the other thing decreases. And we can see from the data that that's not happening. And the second option says that there is a positive correlation between popcorn sales and soda sales. And as we've, we've probably figured out by now, then that's definitely true because as popcorn increases, so does the soda sales. So that would definitely be the correct answer. Um, the statement that there is no correlation is clearly not true because it does follow a pattern. And then simply saying buying popcorn causes people to buy soda, you can't really make that conclusion based on this data. You can definitely assume that it's likely, but um, number two would definitely be the correct answer for this one. So that's it for this video. Uh, thanks for visiting JD's Regions Preparation.